क्वेश्चन वाई डिड द फोटो गो टू जेल बिकॉज इट वॉज फ्री गेट इट ओके डोंट वरी माई टूटोरियल अगर बी बेटर देन माई जोक्स टूडे आई शो यू द इजिएस्ट वे टू सेट अप एनी टाइप ऑफ इमेज गैलरी ऑन योर वर्ड प्रेस साइट एंड एग्जाम्पल हियर इज दिस गैलरी ऑन माई साइट वेर यू कैन क्लिक ऑन अ फोटो एंड देन क्लिक देयर टू ब्राउज टू फोटोज ईजिली वील यूज टू फ्री प्लग इज टू अचीव दिस and you will be able to then create any type of image gallery you want my name is rohan julian francis welcome to our channel and let's begin the first step before we add any new features to our site is to check our website speed most people don't even realize that some of their pages aren't loading properly for their customers so let's just take a moment let's open a new tab and click airlift.net now airlift is a free speed plugin that makes sure our site doesn't slow down because people don't realize it but even small sites with four five plugins and a few products are generally too slow to load so we built this plugin ourselves and are sharing this for free with our community it's super simple let's just go to sign up then add your website url and download the plugin then in wordpress just click on add new drag and drop the plugin install and activate it and your site will automatically get all the speed optimizations it needs and you should see a 90 plus score like this airlift also make sure that your site stays fast as you keep adding more things to it so it's a good long term tool to have all right so let's head over to our wordpress dashboard let's go to posts and then add a new post so let's call this cars now go to the plus icon below this and select gallery now you can either upload images from your device or if you have them stored in your wordpress media library you can take them from here once you're done click on the publish button so let's go to a website and this is what your gallery will look like but there's a small problem here once you click on an image you can view it in full screen but now if a viewer wants to see the next image in your gallery they have to basically go back and click on another image and keep repeating the same process which obviously is quite a hassle right so to solve this issue you need to add a feature called lightbox after that your gallery will look like this users can click on a photo and seamlessly scroll through your gallery like this now there's two ways in which you can add the lightbox feature to your gallery the first is to download a standalone lightbox plugin like simple lightbox the second is to go for an image gallery optimization plugin that offers built in lightbox functionality and a bunch of other features i recommend you go for the second option because you'll also get some extra benefits there now when it comes to gallery optimization plugins there are two plugins which according to me stand out from the rest the first one is envira gallery this plugin is extremely easy to use and first time users will hardly face any problems with it it has a drag and drop builder like this that allows users to easily rearrange and organize images within the galleries it also offers a lot of pre built templates making it easy for users to create visually appealing galleries without extensive design knowledge the only problem here is that it doesn't gel that well with non native editors like elementor which can compromise the user experience it offers free plans along with paid plans starting from about 40 dollars a year the second plugin that i would recommend is next gen gallery this is ideal for those who are looking for a highly customizable gallery plugin it offers advanced image organization options like this and also allows users to select multiple gallery types like slideshows thumbnail galleries and more such rich features make it a great options for advanced users photographers or artists who want to sell their work now if i had to choose one plugin out of these two it would be envira as it caters to both beginners as well as advanced users very well not just that it also tends to load faster than next gen which improves a website's user experience so let's have a quick walk through of how you can create an image gallery with the envira plugin let's head back to our wordpress dashboard go to the plugin section click on add new plugins Then in this search bar, type Envira and download the first option, and activate the plugin once it's downloaded. Now on this navigation panel, you see an option called Envira Gallery. So click on that section, go to Add New, and give your gallery a name. Now upload all the images that you want to add to your gallery from here. Once that's done, you can scroll down, and you will find all your images here. Then you can go to the Configuration tab below. and edit your gallery as you wish for example you can edit the number of columns or the width between images and a whole lot more once you're done editing just scroll up and click the publish button now you can use this gallery anywhere you want on your website all you need to do is go here and copy this short code and then paste it any of your posts which is very easy to do so let's go here select a random post 
Then select the area where you want to add your image gallery, like this. Then go here and paste the code. Then go here and click on the update button. That's it. Your image gallery is now up and running. All right, this is the important part. There are six things that most people forget before making their image gallery live and they regret it later. So make sure you check these boxes before setting up your gallery. Firstly, always optimize your images before adding them to the gallery. Use an image editing tool to resize and compress your images. This will ensure that your gallery loads faster without any compromise to the image quality. Second, while uploading images, you'll see this area. Don't forget to add titles and alt text to your images. This makes your gallery more accessible to users with disabilities and also makes your images more discoverable in search engine results. Third, make sure that your image gallery has a responsive design like this and is displayed properly on devices like tablets and smartphones, for which you can use this plugin. Fourth, always activate lazy loading for your galleries with a plugin like this. Lazy loading ensures that the images are loaded only when they come up on the user's screen. This significantly reduces the initial page load times and makes your site faster. Fifth, don't forget to test your gallery across multiple web browsers like Chrome, Firefox, Safari, and Edge to ensure consistent performance. Lastly, keep a track of all the security updates that are happening in your gallery plugin and install them without fail. Also, make sure that you regularly keep a backup of your WordPress site to prevent data loss from your gallery. Also, in this three minute video, I'll show you our new free plugin to triple your site speed. You're really gonna thank me for this later. So click here and I'll see you there.